Welcome to the channel, you guys. Uh, if you are following me on Instagram, you know that we are rebranding at the moment. So the new name will be revealed soon. So I can't say a name right now. But thank you guys. If you've been here before, if you've subscribed, welcome back. If you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe. Join the community. So today, we're doing a different video than what I usually do. If you look at all the other videos, it's more like uh, quinceanera choreographies, DJ gig vlogs. And lately, I've been getting into open houses and ballrooms and stuff. Um, so yeah. So today we bring you this unboxing. It's something I've been waiting for for a while. I hope you are as excited about this as I am. And here we go. All right, and we're back. Uh, don't worry, no objects were harmed in the making of this video. So we're gonna start off with this one. And yes, whenever you do an unboxing video, you always wanna have some kind of tool to cut your boxes open. All right. And this is from Amazon Prime. I actually got this yesterday, uh, but I didn't get a chance to open it yesterday. So we're doing it today. Here we go. Toss that to the side. Alright, here we got some infamous bubble wrap. Here's little box number two. And, yep. Little box number two. And for the main show. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Let's just put this to the side. We have the Canon. EOS or EOS for whoever it is, Rebel SL2 or D200 or 200 something. I don't know. I forgot what the uh, overseas name is. Here in Dallas, Texas, we call this the Canon EOS Rebel SL2. From what I've seen in, on YouTube and everything, this is a beginner DSLR camera. And this is what I'm going to be using now for my vlogs because I want to get more into vlogs for you guys. Uh, of course, choreography practices. DJ gig vlogs, future unboxings for products. And yeah, I mean, I, ever since I was 10 years old, I've liked doing video and photo. So I'm an amateur video and photography person or videographer and photographer. So I really wanted to start off with something like this. It was $5.49 on Amazon. This one did not include the lens or I got the body only just for the fact that I saw that the lens, which is this one, uh, was $100. So if you buy the bundle kit, which is the camera with the lens, it's $6.99, a regular price. And this Mark II lens, which is still the same, 18 millimeter to one, or eight, sorry, 18 to 55 millimeter lens, Mark II is $100. So $5.49 plus $100 is $6.49. And so I, I, I saved myself 50 bucks. Um, I actually was looking at getting a used one, but then I was like, well, let me try this one first. I'm not sure if there's a difference between the Mark I and Mark II, but for what I'm gonna use it for, I think this is fine. So let's go ahead and get into it. All right, so here's a close up of the product. Like I said, Canon EOS Rebel SL2. Uh, right here it says lens not included. Um, what else does it say? 24.2 megapixels, ISO up to 25, 25,600 for pictures, 12,800 for video. Um, it says uh, up to 5.0 frames per second. It has dual pixel autofocus, which is something I'm really looking forward to because I do like that, especially for vlogging. That way I don't have to worry about it blurring in and out. Uh, Vari angle LCD, which means, I believe, which means um, that it, whatever way you tilt the flip out screen, it's going to be visible, whether you're in sunlight or not. And of course, Wi-Fi, which is really important because if I take a really bomb picture on this, I want to be able to send it to my phone so I can uh, share it with you guys on Instagram. If you're not following me on Instagram yet, you can follow me at this moment. You can follow me on DJ Tweak ENT. Um, and then what's inside this box, I'm not sure if you can see this. Anyways, what's in the box is, uh, the, of course, the camera itself. We got a strap, battery charger, battery pack. Then it says it in French, it says it in Spanish. This is what the picture of the camera looks like, kind of like with the flip out screen. This is the overhead view. This is the front view. 
we'll start off with this little ones first. I actually, uh, actually, the fifty dollars that I did save from getting the Mark II lens instead of the Mark One that came with the camera originally, I bought dual. I bought two extra batteries. So these are two extra batteries with their charger. That way, if I do run out of battery during a video or photo, I just pop one of these suckers in. So here we have the O. A pro I, forgive me if I'm saying it wrong. This is the O. A Prada dual micro USB charger, two battery slots. So this is going to be charged by micro USB and it's just a pop-in battery. Again, this is the LP E17 model. Uh, connect to the charger to connect the charger to a power source via USB cable. You can charge it via power bank. You can charge it via car charger. You can charge it via adapter. Let's pop it open. That's it. Here we have the micro USB charger. I mean, sorry. Here we have the micro USB cable. It's about a foot long. Uh, just regular uh, USB to USB to micro USB cable. I have like 10 of these, so if I don't have that one, I can just use another one. And of course, here comes the charger. It's really flimsy, so just be careful with this. Make sure you don't drop it, because I think if you drop it, it might, you know, be defective or something. Um, okay, so here we have the two... Here we have the two metal ports. The two... Here we have the two... Con connectors for the batteries for both batteries here we have a here we have a channel one indicator and a channel two indicator this is channel channel one down here channel two down here so when you plug them in it'll tell you i guess it'll shine red for charging and then green for fully charged and it shows you oh yeah that's what it looks like nothing on the side except for here goes the micro USB port. So you're just gonna plug this in to here. Ba -bum. And just plug this into any um, USB power adapter. You know what? Here's my thing about everything that comes, uh, uh, everything that gets charged with micro USB is almost no company sends you the actual adapter to plug into the wall. And I mean, I understand why it's cheaper to not send it. But it would be nice because I have maybe 10 of these micro USB cables, but I have two USB adapters, like the little blocks, you know? It's just kind of kind of sucky. Like if I want to charge a bunch of stuff, I have to actually go and get a, a hub and then plug everything into that. Anyways, here we go. So here's the OA Prada batteries. These are the LP E17. It says extra long life battery, A plus battery cell. And let's open it. In the box, you'll get little user guide and the battery itself. It's not big at all. That's good. I thought it was going to be a little bit bigger. It's a 7.4 volt, uh, 1380 milliamp. 10.2, I don't know what WH is, watts per hour, I guess. Uh, science people, y'all are good with this. But yeah, so here's the battery. Here's the other battery. I'm not gonna open the second one because there's not really a point. All right, so we'll go ahead and put this to the side. Next up, we have box number two. This is actually the Canon EFS 18 to 55 millimeter Mark II lens. Like I said, I don't know what the difference is between Mark one and Mark two, um, but it's, yeah, I mean, it's gonna work either way. So I'm a newbie, forgive me. Okay, and that bubble wrap. We got the lens itself. So excited. All right, ladies and gentlemen, and here it is. Again, the Canon EFS 18 to 55 millimeter Mark II lens. It doesn't say Mark II on the lens, so I'm not really sure. Like I said, I don't know what the difference is, um, but I do, I do like this lens. Has autofocus, manual focus, 
and it has stabilization so it does have image stabiliz sorry it this does have an image stabilizer in it um i actually do want to get a uh, actual stabilizer not a gimbal really but you know the vertical one that looks like a little stick all right so here's the back lens cap i like i do like that they include lens cap for both of them okay here's the front one that's a beautiful piece of glass it does feel lighter than i thought i thought it was going to be a little heavier uh i've never actually held a lens by itself before except for my cousin christian's um lens when we went to california last year so yeah that's what it looks like and of course it's boards and I mean, you zoom in and zoom out. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for, the Canon EOS Rebel SL2. Ah, cue the lights. I don't know if I can do that video editing. All right, so if you open up the box, it's not, I saw somebody else that said that these aren't actually factory sealed, which kind of, you know, makes me weird, but hey, it's whatever. So this is a guarantee in French. This from France? Oh, here's in English. So yeah, here's the, um, what does it say? Yeah, this is the warranty from Canon. I want to make sure to read that later on. Here is a small, small, fine printed, small, fine printed book. It is the basic instruction manual, which I'm assuming I'm, I will read eventually. It's like, Jesus. Oh, okay. It's in English and then French. So it's not bad. I'm probably going to read this at work because I get bored sometimes at work. So I'll read through this. Make sure I learn all the features. All right, here we got the register. Here we got the register. Uh, sorry, the thing, the pamphlet to register your camera. And I will do that just because I want to. Man, oh man. Okay, so here we got the Canon, the official Canon charger. It's even lighter than the dual one, but they're about the same size. Oh, no, they're not the same size. But this seems, wait, no, this is a little heavier. My mistake. This is a little heavier. It actually has uh, four connectors on this one. And I'm wondering if it's the same battery. But this has the pop-up. Uh, AC plug, or sorry, it has a pop up power plugs, so you can just pop these up, plug it into the wall, and charge it. There is the charging indicator right here, and then the full indicator. So that's it the Canon battery charger. We have the Canon strap, neck strap. Is US Canon Canon. I'm not sure if I'm going to be using this, but it's nice to have just in case. We have the native battery to the camera. It says, yeah, Canon battery pack LP. Canon battery pack LPE17 and Canon battery pack LPE17. So, yeah, just it's off branded brothers. Comes with a little cap right here. And I'm gonna set this right here to the side. And for the main show, nothing else. Oh, this is a lot heavier than I thought. We have the Canon EOS Rebel SL2, aka 200D. All right, so here we're gonna give you guys a close up of it. Okay, so here 
we're looking at the body of the camera this is where you can see the flap for mic input and I hope to get one eventually so that you guys will have better sound quality there's also a headphone jack for monitoring the audio the back of the camera has a flip out screen has all the controls and then here on the right side you can see the HDMI input and also the input port for the interactive cable that did not come included with the camera which I think is just like a mini USB cable but I'll look into that as well here on top you can see your mode selector switch your hot shoe or cold shoe mount I don't know the typical name for it the Wi-Fi button shutter button zoom in and out all those features again here goes your mini selector on the bottom you'll see the quarter inch thread hole and the battery compartment along with the SD card card compartment and then we come back to the front of the camera and we remove the lens cover Alright guys, so you've seen it now. We got the Canon SL2 in for all the future videos. We're going to be either filming on the SL2, we'll be filming on my Note 8, which you're looking at right now, or maybe my Samsung camcorder. I did just actually find my battery charger for my Samsung camera, which is a Taylor Swift edition that I got a couple years back. Shout out to Taylor Swift, because I am a Swifty. So yeah, I have, I, have, I have what I need now to bring you guys uh, quality YouTube content. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. This is just an unboxing. Like I said, I'm not qualified enough to do a review on it. I'm new to cameras myself. I just do, I usually just do whatever I, I mean, I'm not like a prof professional filmmaker or anything. If you do want to see a review on this camera, please let me know in the comments below. I'll be more than happy to do a, a review of my point of view. That way you guys know what it's like, you know, for just a simple person, just like me, that doesn't really know much about cameras. Again, this is the SL2. Got the 18, 18 to 55 millimeter lens that's going to go with it. If you guys are not following me on Instagram, that's usually where I post the majority of the pictures. Go ahead and do so. It's link, it, the link is below in the description. Or you can just go to DJ Tweak ENT and follow me there. And I guess that's where I, I post a lot of pictures, a lot of videos. I'm trying to, I'm really, really trying to bring you guys weekly videos. I know it's been, I've been really bad at it lately. Um, but I'm going to try to get in that routine um so you like i said to bring you guys great videos all the time hopefully you like this channel if you're returning thank you very much if you have not subscribed yet please do so we are on the road to 1000 subscribers <sighs> yes you guys i'm trying to reach to 1000 subscribers uh if you did not know youtube has actually implemented new policies that uh if you you cannot be a youtube content creator an official YouTube content creator, unless you have a thousand subscribers and four thousand hour watch time. So, like I said, I only, I think I am at six hundred and thirty seven ish subscribers at the time of this video. If I haven't lost any, uh, but I'm at six thirty seven, so I do want to reach a thousand as soon as possible. But hopefully before the end of the year, that way I can become a creator again or an official YouTube creator. If you are not subscribed, go ahead and do so. Hit the notification bell to be notified anytime that I do upload a new video and drop a like or a comment or a dislike hey i won't discriminate but yeah go ahead and you know let me know what you want to see in the bottom i do go i do owe you guys a tutorial for a dance video that is coming up also we will be 
going to another open house on March 11th at Paris Elegant Events in Dallas, Texas on Royal Lane and or near Royal Lane and 35. So go ahead and make sure you're following on Instagram for more information about that. Uh, but as of now, I think our next gig is going, yes, our next gig is March 8th at Williams Prep for their middle school dance. I will be taking this new camera, of course, getting you guys some good footage, hopefully. It's kind of hard for me to do gig logs when it's just me by myself because I got to be mixing, of course. I don't play pre-recorded mixes. I don't play pre-recorded mixes, so I do mix live the whole time. Um, so it is kind of hard for me to get in there and try to get video footage for you guys. But I will try my hardest to do so. And yeah, um, so like I said, thank you guys for watching. And I will catch you guys next time. Woo!